dear students the today's topic is the simultaneity the topic was e m r e l dash 7 we are in the special theory of relativity main topic uh, this is very interesting phenomena of simultaneity uh, imagine that observer o1 sees two events uh, a and B that to him occur at the same time along the X coordinates. So let us see we have two uh, reference frames. This is the reference frame 2. This is the reference frame 1. An event is taking place that observer in the, uh, uh, the frame reference frame 1 observes with the time these are two points uh, A2, B2 with respect to observer 2 and a1 b1 with respect to the observer 1 observer 1 observing these uh, positions as a1 b1 x a1 x b1 and this x a2 x b2 the time is the simultaneous we see that the the observers see that event is occurring at the same time uh, at the both positions a2 and b2 uh, which is observed by the O2 and the observer o, O1 observe that the event occurs at the same position uh, XA1 it observes this event as XA1 and X B, uh, XB1 A1 and B1 are the two points with respect to observer O1. So O1 sees two events A and B that to him occurs at the same x coordinates as uh, the x a1 is equal to x b1 at the same time t a1 is equal to t b1 simultaneously that events takes place at these two positions he observes that he or she observe a and b are simultaneous like two five crackers crack at the same time uh, are the events also simultaneous for the observer O2 who is moving with the uniform velocity or speed v here. This uh, frame of reference is moving with the uniform velocity v. So when these uh, two events which are observed uh, by the uh, observer, uh, the it will say the observer 2 will observe first events are taking place simultaneous. So, will it be the same for the uh, vice versa we can use will be same for the O1 or O2 both observers. So, the now for observer 2 who is moving with the velocity v. Now, from the Lorentz transformation equation for the time it will uh, see T A2 now the observer uh, this uh, moving in the moving frame will observe T A 2 is equal to gamma times T A 1 minus the time uh, as per Lorentz transformation time is given by T A 1 minus V by C square X A 1 and T B 2 as a gamma times T B 1 minus uh, V by C square X B 1 since V is a constant uh, V V is the constant speed of the uh, reference frame. Now, the two events occur at the same time, value of x that are simultaneous for one observer are also simultaneous seems to be for the other, for another observer, provided other observer is also at rest. These two events will be the same, provided that the both are at rest. But if the other observer is moving with a uniform velocity, the two events need not occur at the same time place uh, uh, because the y's and z's can be different that if event events do not occur at the same time uh, at the same value of x sorry at the same value of x if they are simultaneous for o1 then the t a1 is equal to t b t b1 but the uh, since the x a1 is not equal to x a2 they are not simultaneous for the observer O2. In fact, the time interval between the two events as seen by O2 in reference frame 2 is given by 
the difference of these two uh, subtracting these two equation T B two minus T A one A two T B two minus T A two is equal to gamma times T B one minus V by C C square X B one minus gamma T A one and uh, since T B one is equal to T A one is equal to T we consider the time to be uh, the same so gamma uh, we rearranging and simplifying we will see that that this term will be uh, cancelled out because of the the observer O, o is observing as a the same time simultaneous time so that will be equal to but the observer uh, O2 will see that it is not simultaneous rather it is gamma times x a1 minus x b1 v by c square so observer O2 will observe that the cracker at the x a1 will crack first and then uh, the cracker at the x b2 will crack later uh, after that interval so that is called the simultaneity that the event uh, occurring may be uh, simultaneous for one but the the same event may not be simultaneous for the other observer moving with a certain velocity v so that is the simultaneity simultaneity uh, uh, principle or the uh, phenomena. Now let's see this very beautiful animations uh, uh, that will explain much uh, better. So let's see here what we have. Okay. Here the observer moving, and you can see the light two light bulbs hits the train simultaneously observer outside observer is sitting inside this observer observe that the two light bulb heads simultaneously okay so let's see the how observer o2 inside the train will see so observer o2 since we observe when moving still at the, at the same external observer so observing that the two light bulbs are hitting the two ends at the same time but uh, you will see that this observer sitting inside the moving uh, that uh, vehicle which is relativistic uh, level it's moving so that will hit first and then a second later that is how again the observer outside this will observe the inside the observer will see that it will hit first and then later that second one inside the observer and the observer inside is moving vehicle so the external observer is observing simultaneous but internal observer is saying that the light bulb head for so the same event is not simultaneous for the both one may be simultaneous for one or the but for the other observer it may not be simultaneous this guy goes to the ear so with this we reach to the end of the topic thank you